Whenever you have a massive box office failure like Madam Web, there's going to be people that try to point the finger. There's going to be blame that's shifted all around, whether it's on the studio, the actors, how they marketed the movie, or as we've seen so recently with modern day entertainment, they like to blame the fan base. Well, men just didn't show up for this reason. This group of people didn't show up to support this because they're racist, because they're transphobic, because they're sexist. The list goes on and on and on of how many times fans have been attacked in recent years from Hollywood. So when you see a quote out there from somebody, a star for something like Madam Web, that looks like they're blaming the fans, people are going to see that and be very willing to believe, especially in this current environment of so many people in Hollywood attacking the fans, that that's actually something that was said. However, some things are just a little bit too on the nose. Some things just don't seem to be right. So when these quotes surface from Isabella Merced, one of the stars of Madam Web, that she was blaming fans, blaming men for hating women, and that's why Madam Web was a failure, I thought to myself, there's just something that doesn't feel right about this. Combined with the statement saying that Lois Lane's going to be the lead in James Gunn's new Superman movie, a lot about these quotes that were going on didn't make any sense to me. And I was highly suspicious. So when it was brought up, over 24 hours ago when I was doing this stream on Geeks and Gamers, well, these were my initial thoughts. Take her for five. Isabella Merced said she joined Superman Legacy after reading the script. She said Lois is the focus and Superman's more of a background character. Okay, so there is a story that's floating around out there of something Isabella Merced said. I can't find the actual, I don't believe it. Like, I don't think it's actually real. Is that even a real Marvel Studios? So account? this is a Marvel Studios Facebook group okay, that has like thirty six thousand people. Right, it's posted okay. by a random person named Victoria. Okay, and see that's why it, a lot of people are probably running with it because they yes. don't understand. Because that's exactly what I was asking. I was like, wait a minute. All so, right, go and, ahead. And because this is the reason I saw the story because I saw this going around. Uh, Isabella Merced blames the fans for Madam Web failure. It failed for one simple reason. For the same reasons the Marvels or Birds of Prey have failed, because the male audience still hides a deep contempt for everything that is starring strong, independent women. I saw that quote. I'm like, holy fuck, we're going to make a video about that. <laughs> but I cannot find it anywhere other yeah. than this. Yeah. And in the same place, this is where this is being said. Um, Lois Lane is really the protagonist. Superman is the symbol, but she is the ideal brought to action while being a normal woman and real. And... The other thing, it's like she just accepted Hawkgirl when she read the script. But the thing was, I, I don't even know if the script was totally complete when she accepted the role or not. So I, I have big doubts about both of these quotes because I can't find this one anywhere. And it's in the same sentence. So and, and I I'm, know still looking, I'm still looking, but I don't know. And that's the thing is people just don't understand how... Facebook groups work and they just think that's a post from Marvel Studios and they probably think that, that Victoria is like someone that just took the screenshot of the Marvel Studios post, you know? Yeah, that's, so that's I, like I searched for like this quote specifically. I put it in Google. I try, I could not find the source of this anywhere other than this. And here we are over 24 hours later and today we've got articles like this. Fake news. Isabella Merced says Madam Web failed for one simple reason. Where is the source for the claims about what the 22-year-old actress said regarding how the male audience hides a deep contempt for everything starring strong independent women? And this is on Cosmic Book News, so shout out to Cosmic Book News for not running with the fake quote and instead figuring out that there's really not any traction to this. And in fact, Isabella Merced spoke out on this on Twitter earlier this morning. I'm just existing and people are spreading fake quotes and believing them with no real source. We need lessons on media literacy. This is crazy. Now, again, like you heard me say in that clip, from the moment it came out, I had a hard time believing it because it sounds like it's being written by someone who is saying to people what they want to hear. They People want to believe right now that somebody in media would say that about fans because quite frankly, we've heard it before. You know, we've sat here for the last five years and been berated as audience members. If you don't like something, it's because of this reason. Oh, you don't like the Obi-Wan Kenobi series? You must be racist. You didn't go see the Marvels? You must be sexist. We've heard this shit time and time again. Fans have been treated very poorly by the modern day entertainment industry. However, 
if something does not feel right like that, sometimes you got to do a little digging. I did my due diligence. I couldn't find this anywhere, which is why I didn't initially run with the story. And it really does seem like it inevitably came from a Facebook page somewhere, got copy and pasted a few times, but really never any actual link to where she said this. Now, I still, at this point in time, if somebody can find me a clip of her saying that or the actual interview where she said that, uh, I'll certainly criticize her for blaming fans, right? Essentially blaming sexist fans for hating women. That's why this thing failed at the box office. But as of right now, there's enough people to criticize in Hollywood. We don't need to make up shit to do that. We just had a Disney executive come out and basically blame sexist fans on why things like the Marvels and Star Wars fail. We know that happens in the entertainment industry, but it certainly doesn't seem like Isabella Merced is one of the people that came out there and said that. What do you guys think of this entire thing? Let me know in the comments section below. The one thing that can be assured with this entire story Adam Webb, complete and total box office disaster. Let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. Smash a like button, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for notifications, share this video out there, and I'll talk to you later.